Have you ever wondered if something could be so perplexing that even the brightest minds find it baffling? Enter the black hole information paradox, a puzzle that has left physicists scratching their heads for decades. This paradox challenges the very foundations of our understanding of the universe, questioning how information is preserved in the realm of black holes. It's a cosmic riddle that intertwines the destiny of black holes with the laws of physics as we know them. Stay with us as we unravel the mystery of the black hole information paradox. Imagine a place where gravity pulls so much that even light cannot get out. This isn't a scene from a science fiction movie. This is the reality of a black hole, one of the universe's most mysterious and compelling phenomena. Black holes are regions in space where the gravitational pull is so intense that nothing, not even particles of light, can escape from them. They form from the remnants of massive stars that have exhausted their nuclear fuel and collapsed under their own gravity. During this dramatic collapse, if the star's residual core is sufficiently massive, it can compress into an infinitely small point known as a singularity. Encircling the singularity is the event horizon, a boundary beyond which nothing can return. Crossing this threshold is like stepping into the unknown. Anything that passes through is irretrievably lost to the outside universe. It's not a doorway to another dimension, as some might speculate, but rather a point of no return. A common misconception about black holes is that they act as cosmic vacuum cleaners, sucking in everything around them. However, their gravitational pull affects nearby objects only as much as any other object of the same mass. If our sun were suddenly replaced by a black hole of equal mass, Earth and the other planets would continue to orbit as usual, blissfully unaware of the change. Now that we've grasped what black holes are, let's dive deeper into their most baffling puzzle. In the 1970s, a revolutionary idea emerged from the mind of Stephen Hawking. The renowned physicist, already famous for his work on singularities, turned his gaze toward the enigmatic black holes. What he found was nothing short of astonishing. Stephen Hawking proposed that black holes, those celestial vacuum cleaners of the cosmos, were not the eternal prisons they were once thought to be. Instead, he introduced the concept of Hawking radiation. This phenomenon suggested that black holes could emit radiation due to quantum mechanical effects near the event horizon, the boundary beyond which nothing can escape the black hole's gravitational pull. The implications were profound. If black holes emit radiation, they lose energy and thus mass over time. This leads to a slow but inevitable evaporation of black holes. Hawking's calculations bridged the gap between quantum mechanics and general relativity, two pillars of modern physics that had previously stood in isolation. Hawking's theory was groundbreaking, but it led to an even greater conundrum. What happens to information when it falls into a black hole? This question lies at the heart of one of the most fascinating and challenging conundrums in physics, the black hole information paradox. Let's dive deeper. According to the principles of quantum mechanics, information, the details about the physical state of a particle, should be conserved. It can neither be created nor destroyed. However, black holes appear to throw a wrench in this fundamental concept. Imagine tossing a book into a black hole. Quantum mechanics suggests that the information contained within that book, down to the last letter, isn't lost, but somehow preserved. Yet, as the book crosses the event horizon, the boundary around the black hole beyond which nothing can escape, it seemingly vanishes from the universe. The paradox? If the black hole eventually evaporates, as proposed by Stephen Hawking through a process known as Hawking radiation, what happens to that information? Hawking initially theorized that the information absorbed by a black hole was irretrievably lost once the black hole evaporated, a stark violation of quantum mechanics. This led to a significant scientific uproar, as it suggested that information could indeed be destroyed, a concept anathema to quantum theorists. The plot thickens when considering the implications of general relativity, Einstein's theory which excellently describes gravity and the dynamics of large objects like stars and galaxies. General relativity predicts that a black hole's immense gravity affects time and space, but says nothing about losing information. Thus, we find ourselves at a crossroads. This contradiction puts two fundamental theories of physics at odds, quantum mechanics and general relativity. The black hole information paradox not only challenges our understanding of the cosmos, but also forces us to question the very foundations of physics as we know it. How can information just disappear? Is there a hidden escape route we have yet to uncover? Or do we need a new physics altogether to reconcile these giant theoretical titans? A clash of titans, general relativity versus quantum mechanics. 
Imagine two colossal forces, each dominating their own realms of the universe. On one side, we have general relativity, Albert Einstein's masterpiece, which paints gravity as the curvature of space-time, bending around massive objects like stars and black holes. It's a theory that elegantly describes the grand tapestry of the cosmos, the dance of galaxies, and the warping of light. On the other side, there's quantum mechanics, the rulebook for the subatomic world. This framework explains the bizarre, often counterintuitive behaviors of particles smaller than atoms. It tells us about superposition, entanglement, and probabilities. Quantum mechanics thrives in the world of the very small, where particles can exist in multiple states at once, and actions happen in discrete, quantized steps. But when these two theories are brought together, they clash. General relativity says information can fall into a black hole and disappear forever, while quantum mechanics insists that information can never be lost. This contradiction is at the heart of the black hole information paradox. How can information just vanish in a universe where quantum mechanics demands its conservation? This paradox is not just a theoretical skirmish, it highlights a profound gap in our understanding. It suggests that there is a deeper, more unified theory waiting to be discovered, a theory that can seamlessly encompass both the colossal and the minuscule. The quest for unification is one of physics' holy grails. Can the black hole information paradox be resolved? This question has puzzled physicists and cosmologists for decades. As we delve deeper into the enigma, various theories emerge, each attempting to untangle this cosmic conundrum. One prominent idea in the quest for resolution is that information isn't destroyed in a black hole, but rather it's scrambled. Picture a deck of cards. Information, like the order of the cards, isn't lost when shuffled. It's simply rearranged in a way that seems random, but is theoretically retrievable. This theory suggests that while information may seem lost when it crosses the event horizon, it could theoretically be reconstructed. Moving to a more radical realm, the holographic principle offers a fascinating perspective. Proposed by notable physicists, including Gerard T. Hooft, and refined by Leonard Susskind, this principle suggests that all the information absorbed by a black hole is actually stored on its two-dimensional surface, much like a hologram. This implies that the three-dimensional interior of a black hole is a projection of this two-dimensional encoding. Then, there's the firewall hypothesis, a rather dramatic solution introduced by physicists such as Ahmed Almheri, Donald Meroff, Joseph Polkinski, and James Sully. This hypothesis posits that a wall of intense energy, or firewall, exists at the event horizon. Any material, and thus information, that hits this firewall would be obliterated, challenging the very nature of how black holes are understood in the context of quantum mechanics. Each of these theories presents its own set of challenges and implications. Leonard Susskind, in particular, has been a vocal advocate for the idea that information is preserved, arguing against the notion of firewalls and supporting the holographic principle. While no definitive solution exists yet, the pursuit continues to stir the cosmic pot of theories. The black hole information paradox remains one of the most tantalizing mysteries in physics, beckoning the brightest minds to explore its depths. As we edge closer to understanding, the implications of these theories stretch far beyond the confines of black holes, potentially rewriting the fundamental principles of reality itself. Why should we even care about information in black holes? At first glance, the black hole information paradox might seem like a peculiar obsession of theoretical physicists, far removed from practical concerns. Yet, this isn't just a puzzle about distant cosmic phenomena. It's a gateway to understanding some of the most fundamental laws of nature. Solving this paradox holds the key to unifying general relativity and quantum mechanics, two pillars of modern physics that describe the cosmos on vastly different scales. General relativity governs the vast, while quantum mechanics dictates the tiny. Their discordance at the black hole's edge, where extremely strong gravitational fields meet quantum processes, highlights a critical gap in our understanding of the universe. Imagine the potential technologies that could emerge from a unified physics theory. Quantum computing, which already promises to revolutionize industries, relies on principles of quantum mechanics. A deeper understanding could exponentially boost the power and scope of these machines, affecting everything from cryptography to complex systems modeling. Moreover, grappling with the information paradox enhances our computational techniques, pushing the boundaries of what is algorithmically possible. It encourages the development of more sophisticated methods in quantum information theory, which could lead to breakthroughs in how we process and store information on quantum scales. 
So the stakes are high, reaching far beyond the academic. They touch upon the very essence of all physical law and even the future of technology. Unraveling this paradox isn't just about black holes. It's about unlocking the deeper truths of our universe.